With his first action in purple and gold, LSU backup QB Zach Mettenberger did not disappoint. I think he did good. He came in, got comfortable, made some nice throws. I felt like he, uh, he uh, handled the offense well. Mettenberger went 8 of 11 for 92 yards and a touchdown while displaying great accuracy and decision making. Mettenberger's play gained the confidence of his teammates. Guy with uh, you know the first team and getting in there in front of you know Tiger Stadium and uh, it was good for him. It was uh, he had a good night, got off to a good start and uh, did a great job. Uh, let you know in, in this situation something wrong with Jared. You know, Zach can step in and do the same job and continue to uh, roll the offense. Well, Zach did a great job. You know LSU only going to keep the best guys, so him stepping in wasn't no big deal. You know either Lee or Zach getting there is going to be the same for us. But LSU head coach Les Miles says there's nothing to read into here. Jarrett Lee will remain the guy under center for the Tigers. Nothing other than we need to get our second team quarterback ready to roll and you know, just, you know, you never can't tell when you might turn to him and see if we can get a hot hand and go. With a quick turnaround ahead for the Bayou Bengals, resting players like Jarrett Lee was Miles' plan all along. It's nice. It, it means that your starters were not taxed. It means that they should be fresh. And uh, as we go into a short week, that's key. Reporting for Tiger TV, oh, oh. I'm Troy Gallagher. Oh, oh. Three bandidos right now. No, just keep leaving me.